it. We want to get right to this thing, and that is, uh, what is the Big Bang? For folks that missed last week, let's define what is the Big Bang, how long ago did it happen, and what does it show? Well, it's an explanation for the structure of the universe, and in detail what it tells us is that the entire universe came from a cosmic singularity, a beginning in matter, energy, space, and time that has continuously expanded from an infinitesimal volume to its state that we see today. All right, folks, I want to introduce this whole concept to you via a video clip from Hugh's tremendous movie documentary called Journey Toward Creation that we're going to make available. And uh, this will show you a little bit of what we're talking about when we talk about the Big Bang. Watch this. We are passengers on a controlled and purposeful explosion. As if we are microbes riding on a piece of shrapnel from an exploding grenade. All of the universe's matter and energy, even space and time, came into existence in a single moment. But far from a chaotic explosion, this initial blast seems to have been finely tuned, as if it has been designed to benefit us and our tiny planet. Today, our knowledge of the heavens and the earth and the forces influencing them is greater than that of all previous generations combined, and our sense of wonder grows with each new revelation. Now, Hugh, when people watch this, they're absolutely amazed, okay? This whole idea of the, the Big Bang is a, a mind-boggling concept. And it's even so for the astronomers and astrophysicists, some of which are struggling with the conclusions, theologically, that this scientific evidence is pointing them to. Explain that. Well, there's two things that bother these uh, agnostic and atheistic astronomers and physicists. One is when they look at the evidence, what they see in the universe, it all points to this beginning of matter, energy, space, and time, and a continuous expansion in that beginning that tells us that the universe has been exquisitely fine-tuned or designed to make possible the existence of life in human beings in particular. The second thing that bothers them is that thousands of years ago, the Bible accurately predicted all these features of Big Bang cosmology, long before any other book of theology, philosophy, or science even hinted at the idea that we live in such a universe.